What is happening, my peoples? Today I'm playing. You can't really read this because it's in Japanese or Chinese or something, but it says Mermaid Swamp. And it's an interesting game that I found. It's an indie game, indie title. And I thought I'd play a little bit, so let's go ahead and start it off and see what, see what it's like. I think it's a horror RPG kind of thing. My microphone is being dumb. This game contains pro grotesque and somewhat sexual images. Be mindful of this as you play. The author takes no responsibility in advance for any trouble or damage. Damages indirectly brought to you. Uh, indirectly brought about by the game. Cool, bro. Cool story, bro. Rin Yakazami. Yakazaki. What the? Yamazaki. Okay, Yamazaki. Am I underwater? What the hell am I doing? Somebody there? <laughs> Rin, wake up! Oh boy, car. Uh. I'm just gonna call you Seotaro. Stop sleeping already for crying out loud. Ah, shut up. I was just taking a nap. That's so bad. Seotaro. Seotaro. Oh, yeah, Seotaro. Okay, Seotaro, Seotaro. I'm just remembering her name. Um, one hell of a nap. You, Yuda. Yuda's been. Oh, Yuda. Yuda's been driving all this time and you've just been snoozing in the back. Sheesh. Not a hint of a lady in this one. Oh, I'm a lady! I'm a, Rin is a lady. Not exactly interested in being ladylike for an early balding punk like you. <laughs> Boom, right there. I forgot to start my timer. I'm dumb. Rise and shine, Rin. Oh, Yuka. Rise and shine, Rin. I'm going to guess you slept well, given you started around noon. Yeah. But thanks to Baldy here, more of a rude awakening. Quit your yammering, Yakuz ya Yammer Yamazaki 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 Yamazaki. I'm gonna go with Yamazaki. Hey, Yuda, where are we anyway? You said something about kicking things into high gear, but are we in the mountains or what? Haha, <laughs> my bad. I don't know where this is either. <laughs> huh? You telling me we're lost? Yep, don't have a fir don't have the first clue where we are. This is fun. You got to be kidding. You said the mountains were a shortcut, so you knew I th so I thought you knew the way. Sorry about that. I mean, I did kind of know at first, but the fog just got so thick. Haha. <laughs> That ain't funny, shrimp face. This is exactly why I didn't want to go on no trip in your lousy old GPS-less car. <laughs> GPS-less. Ow, don't kick the seat. Well, now what do we do? I can't even see any signs. So this is just like a friend trip? Huh? Yeah. Why did you stop? I didn't. It it just stopped. Hold on, I'll try the engine. Uh, yeah. Oh crap, I think it's totally busted. Crap. Are you for real, dude? Are you for real, dude? I'm gonna... Uh, but that might reset the game, so I'm not going to. You dumb ass. <sighs> Wait here. I'll go take a look. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, I love it now. Let's look at this car. Nothing looks wrong to me. Why the f let's stop? Rin. Oh. S -s Somebody there? Hello there, sir. Quite a surprise. What would you be doing up in these mountains, miss? He's gonna have a British accent. Just an old, just an old coot. Don't freak me out. We were on a trip. But our car went kaput. So I guess we're stuck. 
That's very unfortunate. Is there anything you can stay? Is there any way you can stay? Nah. If we can't get it running, I guess we'll be spending the night in the car. You needn't do that. My home is nearby. You can stay there. Even if it's summer, it's quite cold in the nights. Huh? For real? Well, let me talk to my buds. What do you buds say? That's a relief. Thanks, old man. But you're sure? We don't want to pressure you. Well, I'm a landlord around here, you see. My house is much bigger than my needs. I would appreciate some younger young folk make sure make use of it. I'm really grateful. We'll get the we'll get the car fixed and leave tomorrow. Ah, oh, I can see it now. Whoa, that place is huge. Boop. I'm going to start booping it. Boop. Now that that's a mansion. I kind of feel bad, Gramps, but thanks. Already this is pretty big. Whoa! It's really roomy inside, too. You gotta be rich, am I right? Ha ha. Rich enough to be ashamed of the state of this old place, perhaps. <laughs> Whoa. Come along, and I'll show you to your rooms. You've got a freaking awesome mustache, my friend. You can use this room, Miss Wren. Forgive the old-fashionedness. It ain't nothing. I kind of like the whole retro thing. Thanks again, Gramps. I'm sure all hungry, aren't you? I'll cook some dinner. Until then, make yourself at home. Cool, cool, cool. Let's look in this chest. A chest of va full valuables, maybe? There's nothing inside, though. I don't know why I still have the British accent on. Let's check this place out. Can I run? Not really, so... Anything in the fireplace? A fireplace. Electrical outlet. A desk. Uh, can I leave? I can. That leaving animation is fast. Okay, so yeah, this place is huge. Oh, hello there, sir. What do you have to say? I don't have much food on hand for guests. Would chicken and egg be on rice be alright? What? I kind of prefer something beefier, like, literally, beefier. Unfortunately, I'm not a beef. I must apologize. Oh well, I'll eat anything on this stomach. Or maybe just some on most stomachs. Da da -ch. Um... It ain't that old of a bold b b b b b crap. I'm bad at this. It ain't that old of a building, really. Now see that other pl the other place out back. That's old. Huh? There's another mansion out back. The old man tells me they built this one a generation ago since the other one was falling apart. Huh? Interesting. Are there any mermaids? No. <laughs> huh? That's my room. That's the kitchen. Here's the upstairs. Uh, I'll check upstairs later. Uh, this is Yuto's room. Brent, nice, nice. Your room has a dresser. I ain't got one in mine. This is Yuka. It's a great design, isn't it? You can come over to to do makeup in the morning. Hey, thanks a bunch. I don't do makeup. I'm not a girly girl. Didn't you hear? This is Yuda's room. What's up with you? Hey, Rin, you see that big swamp in front? <gasps> Are there any mermaids in it? Yeah, the one you can see out the windows. It's super huge, isn't it? Maybe I'll I'll go swimming tomorrow. Yeah, uh, stay away from me after you do that, because you're going to reek. Yuda's weird. I like him. I don't know. Oh, what's in here? A telly. I want to watch some telly. What's in here? Nothing. I'm gonna go back out then. Don't know whose room that is. What's in here? It's locked. Shocker. Oh, what's in here? 
another telly, and a phone. An old phone. Back out. This place is like a maze, but it's actually pretty simple. Can I go back outside? I can? Seriously? Whoa, that's one big swamp. Hmm? It's a rock with writing on it. What's this? A stone monument? <clears throat> uh, a man did abduct from the seashore. Crap, I can't read this. <laughs> Maybe Sietaro didn't know about this old stuff. He's got more knowledge as he knows what to do with. Yeah. Curious about the monument. Ah, jeez, old man. You gotta not do that. Oh, my apologies. Did you read the inscription? Nah, I couldn't make heads or tails of it. What's it say? It's a legend that's told around here. I'm tired. It's a legend that's told around here. The legend of the so called mermaid swamp. L legend? It's right. It, it, it originated in the middle of the Meiji me me era. My family has governed this area since around that time. It is said the son of a leader descended the mountains down to the seaside and discovered a mermaid. Sounds shady right out of the gate. Haha, -ha. well, it is a legend. The man was so smitten with the mermaid's beauty that he took her to his mountain home. He created a fish tank for her to live in, and he filled it with water from this very swamp. But a mermaid of the sea cares not for swamp water. The mermaid grew weak and became quite ugly. Her clear skin was swelled, her scales fell off, and her voice, as melodic as as ringing bells was reduced to a beastly hollow howl. The mermaid took on a most repulsive form and sub subsequently died. Whoa. And a mermaid's wrath and a mermaid's wrath is no pretty thing. Young women vanished from the nearby village. It is said to be the mermaid's curse. As such, this monument was put up to mourn her. What do you think? Hard to call it romantic, but interesting on nonetheless, eh? Uh, yeah. Sorry, I don't know about all that. To tell it, tell it to Cetro. He likes stories and stuff. Ah, is that right? Well, I've prepared dinner now, so come to the dining room if you would. Ooh, finally, let's get a move on. Yummy, 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 yummy soup. This is some great stuff, old man. I'm glad you like it. You can slow down a little, though. Ah, the bath is free. Um, if anyone wants to use it. You must be tired from the day's events. Please rest yourselves. See ya, bro. Yuka, aren't you gonna eat? What's up? Yeah, I guess I'm just too tired. I have an app I to have an appetite. No. Whoa, you okay? We'll clean up. You can get some rest. Alright, thanks, Yuda. <coughs> yummy yummy. Y'all clean up now. <laughs> Why do we have to clean up after you? Do it yourself, yummy yak yummy yaki? Yummy yucky. Yeah, work on your names while you're at it. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm stuffed. I'm ready to conk out after that bath. You had a bath? Mm. Should I just go to sleep then? Wow, that's fun. Nice fluffy bed. Mm. Oh, what do you know? I don't... Oh, uh, screen turned black now. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. Uh, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. 
Um, see you guys in the next video of whatever the heck I make. See you guys then. Bye. <laughs> really tired. <laughs>